Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing great. Happy October, happy spooky season. It's It feels like it's been so long since I filmed and it's only been about a week. Like the first week of October, I was not able to film, but we're gonna do some word search puzzles today because I definitely haven't done puzzles in a little, a little bit of um, time scary story tell me a place a vampire would love to hang out i guess this is very fitting so let's do this oh and this is my first spooky set of the month so i have some pennywise and some slashing going on and some more slashing and the screen mask nice fun fun nails um, hopefully I'm able to change my nails more often this month because for the last, I see monster, monster roof, monster, okay. for the last, oops, couple of weeks, I have barely had my nails done. Um, it's, it's feel, it's been feeling very weird. <laughs> But I have been focusing on other things. Um, I'm not going to say I didn't have the time. I, could, I always make the time to do my nails. I just did not feel like making the time. <laughs> Last week, I really took the time to not do much, to be honest. Um... Yeah, I just, I really took it easy. And that included not doing my nails. Because to be honest, once I sit down, I see ghosts. Once I sit down and start doing my nails, then I start making a bunch of sets and I start making items for my my shop and things like that. And, and one, you know, I'll sit down and say, okay, I'm going to do one set. It turns into me being there for hours, so I did not play myself and even do my own nails. <laughs> but I did them yesterday. And they're so cute. Hopefully I will make more time this this month because I have so many ideas for nails. Um looking for boogeyman. So many ideas and just not enough time. I crossed off horror. Let me look for that now before I forget. I crossed it off by mistake. So, um, um still looking for horror. I feel like it's somewhere over here and I keep overlooking it. Feel like I keep looking somewhere over here. I see a bunch of O's over here, that's why. The weather has been so great. It's actually been a little bit warmer um, than I guess I expected for October, but that's New York weather. New York weather is just so weird. Um, where is Hara? Oh, I see blood. Is this a word here? No, it's not. So, blood bank. So that is probably one of the places that a vampire would like to hang out. Not sure if it's number one or number two. Number one, I'm gonna assume is like, I don't know, where do I wanna say a cemetery, but I don't know about that. All right, so I'm gonna put blood bank as number one. I usually never get these, the order of this correct, correctly anyway, so. Um, it's okay. Oh, here goes Hara. Yeah, this weather, whoop, this weather has been warmer than expected. 
So I'm guessing, um, hoping for some nice weather on Halloween. Last year, it rained a little bit. Like towards the evening, it rained. Boogeyman. I think I'm going to go to the Halloween parade this year. We have a Halloween parade in the village every year for Halloween. And I think I might go. I don't really have any other plans. Um, oh, I, I am going to go to like Fright Fest and Six Flags and, you know, try to go to haunted houses and things like that. But like on Halloween day. Frankenstein and Halloween is what I'm looking for. And we have seven answers to fill in here. I've been seeing flower, but I don't know how, how that would be an answer here. A place, flower, yeah, flow, no, yeah, wolf, oh, werewolf, okay, <laughs> look at that, it's, it's flower, but werewolf backwards, okay. Okay, now we need Frankenstein Halloween. We're gonna finish off this little row here. I still am not even sure what I'm gonna be for Halloween. I have some ideas, but I'm still not sure at all. This is like Probably the first year that I'm really, really not sure at all what um what I'm gonna dress as. Supernatural. Okay, I need more answers for this. Sometimes the answers just pop up. Caves. Here we go. I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna say caves. I'm assuming they might want to hang out in dark places, so let's see if Cemetery is there. Or, like I was saying, sometimes we do find answers in here for this without really thinking about it. Like caves, I would. I didn't. I was not thinking um, of that answer. I see roof. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna. I'm gonna cross that off. I'm not into vampire stuff. Like all the vampire type movies, I don't really watch like that. Um, I tried to watch Queen of the Dam the other day, and I don't know, I just couldn't get into it. I guess I'm going to have to sit down and watch it again. From what I hear, it's really good, but um, I, I eventually, I just stopped it, and I put something else on. But I'm not really too much into the vampire movies. I did see Twilight. Okay, definitely. I saw Twilight. I read this I read the Twilight series a long time ago and I absolutely love the books. And the movie was um it was okay. I still enjoyed the movie, but Kristen Stewart, I 
I really didn't like her in that movie. I know she, I think she's supposed to be acting that way, the way she acted in the movie, but it was, it was just too annoying for me. So the movies are good, but I don't go looking to watch it again, basically. So, a place vampires like to hang out. Um, I did say we were going to look for cemetery. What else? Or maybe it'll be put as graveyard instead of like cemetery. Yep, look at that graveyard right here. Graveyard is probably number one or two. And then we have three more answers. That's tough. Transylvania. There we go. That might be number one or, or two. That's probably up there. Transylvania. That just reminded me of Rocky Horror Picture Show. And actually, I was thinking of being one of the characters from that um, movie. That was one of my costume ideas. I might, I don't know, I might stick with that. Might have to stick with that. Let's see. We have two more answers left. I'm not going to take up too much time trying to find, find and we will move on. Cause I don't even have an idea. I'm honestly just looking to see if I see your word. Um, a basement. Look, see, there we go. Look at that. I'm sure that's a place they will hang out. It's basements are usually dark and secluded. Speaking of secluded, maybe an alley. I don't know. Yeah, I would think like an alley or an, uh, huh. I'm trying to think of dark places, secluded places. Yeah, that's my last, um, answer i don't know i can't think of anything else i'm gonna put alley but i didn't see it in there so i'm gonna do one more puzzle and then we'll check the answers this is page 157 on the money name something whose face someone whose face appears on the money nah. which part of the body can be used as a weapon See, when it comes to this, I'm just going to name body parts. <laughs> I think I might just do that one because I don't, I don't know anything about martial arts. Let me just adjust. Name a way people get rich quick. Hmm. We'll do this. I think this will be easier. Again, I'm just going to name body parts there and see if I find them. <laughs> I'm sure a hand is there, maybe a foot, your knee, taekwondo. I have always wanted to take a boxing. I know my gym has some boxing classes. That I may consider.
do. I have been trying, well, I've been drinking the C4 energy drinks. I've been doing a lot of working out at home. I've had to, um, well, not had to, but I've been, I have a, a, a competition coming up, pole competition. So I've been practicing and doing a lot on the pole and working out at home. But I've tried, um, I've been trying to see four energy drinks. They're pretty good. So that is what I'm drinking right now. I really haven't found, actually, I found one substitute to Monster. Yeah, so I found one substitute as far as the energy drink that I like that gives me energy and doesn't have me crashing. And that is, um, it's something, it's a drink called Aspire. I, I really like those Aspire energy drink, like, or natural energy drink. Um, but yeah, I wanted to try something else I've been trying to see for is I like just trying energy drinks in general. And then if there's something I like, I stick with it when I can. But um, it's been okay. The C4s, they've been okay. Jiu-Jitsu. Yeah, so I have a competition in a couple of months. Well, I have about two months to practice. Come, come up with a routine and practice and just go over, you know, things like my, what I'm going to wear and theme and things like that. So... It's been a good amount of work along with other, just everyday other things I have to do. It's been very fun though. Um, but I need, I've been needing all the energy I can get. So last week was last week was great for that with me getting energy because my way of doing that was kind of doing the bare minimum. <laughs> like I said, I really gave my talent myself time to relax and not do much last week and kind of recharge, you know, recharge and uh, I thought I found karate recharge. And, um, okay, having to stop, it has been, it's been throwing me off in my conversation. I had to stop for a few minutes just now. Somebody's car is so loud. I forgot I was saying something about resting. Well, I think I was saying, yeah, um, just allowing myself to get, I was getting things done last week, um, but I wasn't crazy all over the place like I usually would be, and just allowing myself that time to just relax, 
and um, not do the most to kind of like build and gather up that energy and recharge basically recharge time I pause it like throws me off sometimes you guys don't see it obviously but sometimes I have to stop the video for sometimes it's a few seconds and then sometimes it's minutes there's definitely been times where I had to be like oh okay I gotta come back later to this I'm just gonna leave this here and then come back half hour later because <laughs> noise or then I get distracted somehow with something else so it kind of throws things off. I'm still looking for a collab. I see all these caves. And I still haven't I still haven't um filled this. Let's let's fill in a couple of these. I'm gonna say arm or leg. Okay, here's leg right here. But let me make sure. Which part of the body can be used as a weapon? Alright, I'm gonna say leg. Um, I think like maybe hand or head is number one. I don't know. I don't know. Again, I don't know nothing about karate. Or about martial arts either. I'm thinking of karate, but I'm still trying to find it. <laughs> still trying to find karate. Karate, is it, it said, pronounced? I always think of Spongebob when I, <laughs> if you watch Spongebob, then you know. Um, all right, so I said head or hand as a uh, weapon, a body part that can be used as a weapon. Here goes head, so I'm gonna say that's number one. I guess if you're experienced with <laughs> headbutts and things like that, our heads are, are heavy. I cannot imagine getting like headbutt by someone or okay. Um, I do think hand or something is probably number one though. I should have put that head as number three. All right, so. Foot. Here goes foot. Um. Hand. We still got to find some of these. And I said hand. I wanted to find that really quick before I look for these words I'm sure it's in here I'm sure it's one of the answers um, all right I'm gonna move on for, for right now because I really can't I really don't see hand in here all right so we have one two three four more left here which part of the body can you use as a weapon
Here's what I have. Head, legs, and foot so far. Okay. All right, we're done with these. So, hand, arm, knee, knee, knee. That's the answer for here. I, I told y'all, I'm just gonna be guessing and seeing if it's in here and putting it in there if it is. I'm saying arm, hand, and knee. Let's see if we find any of those body parts. Um, he goes arm. I wonder if fingers, fingers is in here instead. I barely even see any S to be honest. Um, okay, we have two more. And... Let's go through the body parts. Uh, elbow. Oh, elbow maybe. Okay. I really want to finish this. I only have two left. I feel like that would be easy to find body parts. <laughs> the kid should just guess it and find it. I definitely think elbow is in there and I felt like hand will be in there. I feel like that might have been one of the top answers, but I don't see it. So elbow, hand, and knee. I'm wondering if, hmm, nah. I was thinking maybe if they put arm here, then there would be elbow, because arm is considered your whole arm. But I don't think so. All right, so I'm gonna put my answers here knee and hand and we're gonna end it and we're gonna find the answers right now and take one last look over all right so the answers are on page 150 martial arts so look number one is hand yep i cannot find it and knee is in here all right seriously i was right i wasn't right about all the the orders um i did figure hand was in the top i don't i'm not really sure why but head head was like last answer <laughs> um knee arm leg but okay, so hand and knee. Oh, I see knee. He goes knee right here. I think I just saw hand too. Mm, no, I didn't. Let's find it in here because it 
and goes all the way down here. And then the other one we did was page, it was, I forgot what page it was. If I just skim through, I'll we'll come across it. Um, we passed it. Wait, it was page. I think the answer was on page 150 something. Let me just, I'm gonna look through here and see if I see. Okay, that's not working. Okay, I'm over here looking for something vampire related and it's called Scary Stories. 157, the answers on. It's page 114. All right, so I said an, an alley is the last answer. An attic, wait a minute. Some of these answers I have here, I don't even think is the answer. Like roof is not there. Yeah, that looking back, that doesn't sound like a good answer. So blood bank is there, which is number one, I was correct. Cave is number two, I was correct about that. Three is number is graveyard, correct about that. The fourth one is a nightclub. I guess that makes sense because uh okay, so nightclub and attic. I guess that makes sense because maybe they can find their next victim <laughs> in nightclub. And it does seem as though all of these vampire movies has a like nightclub scene. So I guess they get they hang out with other vampires there or they get their next meal. So attic and um a nightclub i would have never thought of nightclub to be honest it was nightclub all right we're done so that's it for today thank you so much for tuning in i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you guys next time Make sure you take care of yourselves, and I hope you guys enjoy your spooky October month. If you're into, you know, all the festivities, I hope you have a great one. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.